Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add floating footer sticky bottom ad into your WordPress website. So you have no need to install any kind of plugin for this. I will be showing you step by step that how you can copy and paste the code and then you are done. So currently on my screen you can see that in the bottom I have uh, this specific ad displaying. If I am closing this one, this is just hide it. So for example I am navigating to any other blog post and there it would also display so here here we go now you can see that in the bottom again uh, the ad is displaying all right so let me show you how i did this so before continuing everything uh, you can see that i have written a blog post you can also follow this step by step so i will be uh, going through uh, uh, each and every step in this specific video so first of all i am going to remove the code which i have added first of all because in that way i will able to show you that how i added everything from scratch so let me publish this and then i have some more code over here so let me remove this code also and let me click on update file so now we will uh, go through the blog post and follow each and every step and then uh, add some code which i already told you so for example if i am refreshing now the page then that ad would not display in the bottom so here we go in the bottom we have no more ad why because i have removed the code so let's follow the blog post so here we have steps the first step is open footer.php file so for that how we will be opening it go to wordpress dashboard then click on appearance theme editor footer.php all right so let's move ahead with the dashboard so here we have the dashboard and we need to scroll it down click on appearance then we have uh, install uh, theme editor click on this now we will be redirected to this screen so in most of the cases you will be getting footer.php on the right hand side i have less number of files because i am working on child theme if you have parent theme then it would look like this so here you can see that there are multiple files and here we also have footer.php so currently i am working on child theme if you have child theme then you should add the code over there so here you should click on footer.php and then you should paste some code so let me show you how you will do so we have opened the uh, footer.php first step is completed second step is paste below code just above body close body tag so here you can see that i have close body tag so i need to paste the code just above this so this is the code i am going to copy this and then after i need to paste just above the body tag so i pasted that then after replace add your add your ad uh, add code here line with your ad code this means that i need to replace with the actual ad code so how i will be doing that is i should go to my adsense account and here you should click on ads then overview and click on buy ad unit then click on display ads then here you need to uh, click on fixed all right so this should be fixed why because in some cases if you have added responsive then it would approximately 30 percent of your uh, screen would be covered with the ad and that is not a good idea so in that way your uh, website would be blocked to uh, show the ads all right so you have we have no need to uh, take such kind of risk for that we uh, only need to use fixed ad so here we should uh, write the name mr dg tells fixed footer bottom ad all right then you should click on create and now we need to click on copy code snippet this code would be copied and now we will be pasting in the over here here you can see that we have your ads code here i am going to delete this and going to paste the original script of my ads now i need to click on update file so this will save these changes and next step is add below css in appearance customize uh, custom css so let me show you how first of all you should go to dashboard then you can see that we have appearance we have customized click on customize then once that is loaded then you should go to uh, custom CSS 
let me show you so if you will scroll down then you will be getting custom css click over it and go at the bottom and down below i need to add this code so let me copy this code again and let's paste it here so i pasted it and let's publish this page uh, these changes so we are done so all these steps we followed now let's refresh the page and check that the ad is displaying or not so here we go just a moment yeah so now ad is loading you can see that down below the ad was displayed so let me navigate to any other now you can see that the ad is displaying in the bottom all right so if you are closing this you can click on close and that would be hide it all right so this is the way we can actually integrate this specific code to display the ads uh, in the footer so here you can see that in the bottom the ad is displaying so that means uh, we have implemented step by step and we are successful now if you are thinking you are facing any kind of uh, issue uh, or maybe you want any kind of uh, modification so you can ask me below in the comment section i will be happy to uh, help you out with any kind of technical problem all right so uh, one more thing one more important thing that i need to share with you is that i have created one uh, website that is keywords.com and over there i have many uh, tools which i have created those are free of cost so you can use for your seo purpose if you have a youtube channel you can also use for that so for example i am adding here a uh, keyword then click on search and you can see that i have some ad data of this keyword like monthly searches cost per click ad competition i have uh, past 12 months data uh, this one and i have some related keywords if you are exploring any youtube uh, tool so here you can see that i have multiple tools like tags generator for example i am clicking on any tag that is tag is generated and i can copy this and the, some other things like title generation hashtag thumbnails so there are multiple things which you can explore on the left hand side so if you are thinking this was this video was useful for you then please subscribe this channel and also like this video thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next one